Excellent serving. Well, that's her best service game so far, and a real tonic for her. So that's the situation at the moment. First set to Steffi Graf. One love, though. Mary Pierce leading in the second. Mary, who didn't play at Wimbledon, as I said, because of all the controversy surrounding her father, or at least that's what she said was the reason, although there were other people who were saying that uh, she wasn't going to do too well on the grass anyway, and subsequently she said she needed a rest. So she played in the Federation Cup, but that's the only competition she's played in since her amazing time at Roland Garros where she lost in the final to Arantxa Sanchez Vicario after her crushing win over Steffi. And ironically, since then, she's moved up in the ranking list from 12 to 5 because she had such a miserable time last year and her average went down. Whereas this year, she has such a high average and the girls around her have all dropped off. So she's moved up to her highest ever position on the computer, which is five. Steffi, of course, comfortably number one, although Arantxa Sanchez Vicario and Conchita Martinez, French and Wimbledon champions, have made one or two inroads into her massive lead. Just keeping a guessing on serve. There's a heck of a lot of movement the other side of the court when Steffi lines up for a second serve. And again, she's put off. She knows it's going to be a crushing reply. Well, just look at Mary here. Many agree with that court. Well, she's saying here that the line judge was not unsighted and therefore she can't overrule it. Too close to overall, but you could see from our replay that it was a very bad call. Once again, showing her maturity and biting back like that. 
before, just up until last year, really, the anxiety would deepen when she gets calls like that. Eager to impose herself. So Steffi has another point to level up at one each. And again, and you can sense the frustration in Steffi. So Mother Heidi there with the dark glasses. And the serve is definitely very edgy. And there's a real chance here for Mary Pierce to go a break up. And even more now. This is Steffi as edgy as she's been, certainly against Sawamatsu earlier on in the week. And she's a girl here who can beat her. And Mary Pierce on top now. The graph serve breaking down there. And the uh, velocity of these returns getting its own reward. Two love now. And is this the dramatic switch in the match? in the end. <laughs> Just murderous force behind that forehand. And a big smile to her mother and coach. She's outgunning Steffi now, and as long as she can eliminate the mistakes, she has another famous win within her grasp. Still a lot of work to be done. Take that, says Steffi, who's uh, had to take a fair amount of that herself. Thirty. 
Oh, sensational play from Mary Pierce. And at the moment, she's destroying Steffi Graf. But she still trails by a set. So Steffi Graf, already one breakdown in the second set. Mary Pierce leading three love, but first set to Steffi Graf, 6-3. Steffi could do that was a pretty decent second serve but it didn't mean an awful lot three shots later she just hates to defend Wonderful heading. Searching for the line. Forehand, then the double hander to within three inches of that baseline. her character on Steffi and again she gets the first serve out now look at the movement vital game Just two breaks down to Pierce. She can kiss this set goodbye. Nice yeah. cut of play. Just occasionally she floats that top spin tantalizingly towards Steffi, and she's made a mess of it a couple of times now. Nothing kind of shot by her standards and uh, was duly punished. Oh. What an important service game for Steffi Graf. And she hangs on, but only just. And again, very close call indeed. If he looks across, but I think may have feared the worst, but got the call in her favour. Pierce at 3-1.
Well, she's showing signs in the second set of the sustained brilliance we saw at Roland Garros, time after time, but particularly in the semi-final. But it shouldn't have needed that final one. Still not totally comfortable when she moves forward, but eventually did the job. No doubt who's making the running here. Invariably, the points are being won or lost on the last shot from Mary Pierce. It's not now about how well Steffi plays so much as how well Mary plays from here on in. And thinking well as well. with such devastating power that when she does play an accurate drop shot she's got her opponent so far back miss that sometimes going wide to the double hander down the line rarely misses cross court but does there in no uncertain fashion turning into a difficult service game now. She looked to be storming away to a 4-1 lead. Not that time. A tactic that's generally in this set forced the error out of Steffi, but this time just catches it a little wrong. And here's a, another vital point. Break back point for Steffi Graf. Well done, had the courage to come in there and finish.
She's just as uh, uncertain as her opponent when she does go forward, but there seem to be too much doubt there. So the break point saved. She looks down court. She can't quite believe that serve. is gone. Break point number two. And definite kink in the service action. Is power with power, a raking forehand from Steffi, and came back with interest on the double hand. Pierce would dearly love this point now. Good movement and control from both players until that final drive, just about a foot long of the baseline. This for a 4 1 lead, second set. His serve seemed to be breaking down 10 15 minutes ago. The service action looks distinctly wobbly. Oh. I still know if there's a problem with the movement. She's twist and exercise around the hip area to try and loosen up for once the footwork not too good there and here's a third break point now for Steffi Graf to level up on breaks see mistakes like that from Steffi she does so well to get in position and had a bit of time there it wasn't that close in the end
hauled wide. Looks as if it might have got the outside of a line, but no overall. Doesn't look to me like she's getting the brakes. Yes, it did look like it got the outside of the line. Here we go. Very difficult. It just might have been out. player particularly happy Let's have one last look here floats it down the line now no it was out don't think it's still very difficult even at that slow motion to pick it but it doesn't look to me as if it did take any of the line but uh, Mary Pierce has had it reversed It's about time she had a bit of luck going her way. <laughs> this game now has added value. seeming to be just about to stop the impetus. Second serve. And, uh, quite a few gave a prolonged clap on that second double fault. And here, Steffi has her fourth break point here.